where did your nurse run off to? I gave her the night off. Oh. Well, I couldn't have you go to bed without dessert. Marta made of the most delicate profiteroles. No, thank you. I'm sorry to bring this up, but whatever happened between you and Daniel in the pregnancy, or lack thereof, is a private matter between you two. However, while you were unconscious in the hospital, the doctors came to Daniel with these test results. When you came to, we feared that you weren't stable enough to face them, so I volunteered to deliver the news to you when you were ready. But now I'm not sure if I'm able to do it. What is it? Because of the location of the bullet wounds and the surgeries required to save your life, the doctors had no choice. A sacrifice had to be made. I'm afraid you'll never be able to conceive, Emily. You're lying. No. Feel free to confirm with Dr. Sturman or seek a second opinion. You see, this is why it's been so tragic for Daniel and why he's been so distant. For you to have given him hope for an heir, only to have it taken away from him forever. Get out. Fate can be so cruel. a beautiful party. I can't believe Charlotte's 19. Birthday brings to mind many things. For a parent, it stirs up memories of a day blessed by a miracle. A joyful gift cherished for years to come. Sadly, it's an experience you'll never have. Which makes me wonder, who were your parents? Where did you come from? And why are you still here? <laughs> 